You know, like the youth in the country, unemployment is one of the things that that causes the insecurity in the country. Okay. There is a, a word that says an idle man is an, uh, a devil's, a devil's uh, worship. What I mean by that, when you see youth are not being busy doing things, earning what they are supposed to earn, what do you expect them to do next? They are to go out there, you know, involving themselves in courtes, in all sorts of things that is not, you know, they are not supposed to do in the country. And uh, what I also see there is, uh, to, to our leaders, self-centered. They are so self-centered. They have it and they don't want to be their brother's keeper. We are all black men, a black men from the same country. We are Nigerians. When you look at this country, this country never been like this before. But with the situation of the country now, we don't know where we are heading to. You see kidnapping here and there. You see people dragging what doesn't belong to them. You know, and no youth now eventually want to work. Because when they kidnap, they earn more money. How much are you now going to give to them? We need more so uh, more 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 uh, uh, force men, you know, and likewise those ones that have been taken away from the force, dismissed, that are pleading for them to be reinstated back. The federal government should do one or two things to bring them back. We know all fingers are not equal. There are some bad ones. There are still some good ones. Without them being there for us as securities, we are insecure in the country. That is my contribution to it. Okay, may I sunan kam? Hi, my name is Sunana Yusuf Biza. Okay, Yusuf Biza. Tumba yende ni kesi yema kadi rana na shine. May kake gani yake kaura shintero akasa na Nigeria? Tora hins arode dele fuma eka. Dele fuma na shuga benumu sabi da country dele adamantiwa ba wani me fada suni na siki abunda sekadama akai. Do one hins arode na gani shuga bani de jami ansaro. Yenzi kaduba de yenzi especially in police chair akasa na zate gari zate gari. Ama police basa mida angkali ya kang wanang aike. Sina yung wana aike ni nasu na kashin kansu. Kwa yana binda mwa kansa ni. Baweda mwa kwantirin bayi na kuwa di chiga ba. Kadube yinkin za mfara. Da katsina. Irang abundi yike faruwa. Dwa yinki me duguri abundi yike faruwa.
Obviously, the security situation in the country is getting bad day by day. By my own opinion, I think we should overhaul all the security architects, architects altogether. And you know, security is not one man business. It's a business of everyone. But principally, the power is vested on the security outfits, the military, the police, and other security body. What we need to do is to make sure that the society the society is such so adequate, like adequate policing, our roots have adequate policing and surveillance work. 
and also the community of people should report to appropriate authority when they suspect anything. And to other, on the other hand, we should look at it, you know, things don't happen like that. There must be a reason that metamorphose to it, most especially when you live in a society whereby there is poverty, unemployment, the youth will involve themselves in social vices. And these are what we are seeing today in Nigeria. Like, people are hungry to make money or to get anything by anyhow. So government needs to provide work also to cope this situation, to employ such youth and to change some of their mentality. You know, and also I think the problem of security in this country is because of the way government are handling it another way around. Like the Boko Haram, you notice that they are being given amnesty. Another one will say, okay, we want to do so that we'll be given amnesty. Another one will emanate from some parts of the country. You see, we are not happy matters. What government needs to do, they should take all the nation, all the country on our shoulder to make sure that they prefer on making the environment good for the youth to be able to harness, be it business or anything you venture in. So when one is busy doing something, it will not find himself into another thing doing. Another aspect of this are the politicians. They are the causes of it because they use the youth for thuggery during election. They have get them involved of it to involved on using of arms. And after the election, they don't seem to take care of them. They'll go back to the creek or wherever, to the street or wherever, to be doing bad things because they have the arms. Ordinarily, a poor man cannot access arms. He doesn't know where they sell. He cannot afford it. So these people, there's a brain behind it. It's not only getting those people doing the art. Who is the brain behind it? Who is sponsoring them? You understand? So it's an overhaul things that government need to do. Even us, the society people, don't say that this person is my brother, this person is my... In as much the person is a criminal, fish him out and let it be taken out of the society, else it makes the society become um, variable for everyone.